All right, y'all, let's go. I'm looking for a couple of Bobo items, some particular ones. So we're going to see what they got. But I know I'm definitely here for the waters, three for 10 waters. And I'm going to see what else they got, all right? Um, so let's just get right into it, all right? Let's see what Publix got going on. I'll show y'all what I have um, once I'm done. You know, they got the beef broth, which is buy one, get one. Um, hold on, I'm trying to lay this lady by here. So like I was saying, they got the beef broth right here, um, which is buy one, get one, which is good. Uh, the chicken broth, they have that as well. I like to put that inside my rice when I'm making the rice. It tastes amazing. Um, and if you're not the one that likes to cook rice, a lot of people don't like to cook rice, whatever, because they always say rice is difficult sometimes. A lot of people say that. If, if it is, if you're one of those people, add your chicken broth to it and it'll come out amazing, all right? Say I told you so. All right, so let's go. I'm just gonna be skimming through the aisles, looking for what I'm looking for. They have bogo on the soups. I don't need any of that. I bought some last week. I bought that new one that they had now here. Oh, this one. This is the one I bought last week. And it, um, I got that one from Walmart, actually. The Old Bay one right here. I'm not. I don't care for uh, the seasoning stuff, but it just looked interesting and I said I'm gonna try it out. So so we'll see, I'm gonna try it out and let you guys know how it tastes, all right? So just enjoy the browse and I'm gonna do shop like I am and then I'll show you guys what I have decided to get, okay? So enjoy the little ride. Come chilling with me on this Saturday, what is up? What y'all got going on today? Well, it'll be Saturday when I put up when this video goes out. But you know, I'm always a little bit ahead of time that I'm filming. So I just figured I'd throw a little grocery vlog in. Take y'all a little bit with me to see what I'm doing. Okay, so we don't need to see no pampers. Hi, hi, right, how y'all doing? Well, they got old um, Oreos on sale. Two for eight. The gluten ones are good if y'all think it ain't no difference. It's just don't have the gluten in it, which is better for you. Have anybody tried these? Let me know. Let me know in the comments if anybody tried these because I tried them, the chocolate chip one. I ain't careful. I'm gonna see what the hype is all about. Let me know what you think. Y'all, let's see. I see everybody. Is Are y'all eggs high in y'all state too? Look, 8.30. Free range, 6.26. Brown eggs, 7.02. I like Trader Joe's um, eggs that's already peeled. They taste amazing. I don't know why, for some reason, they taste so different. But I'm just showing y'all the prices. This egg seems to be the topic of discussion now these days. Six forty-seven. $4.36 for those. $9.81. But like I was saying, I like um, Trader Joe's ones that's already peeled, like these. So they're $3.39 here with six eggs coming in. Boiled eggs. But Trader Joe's boiled eggs, y'all, is amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. The taste, I've never tasted an egg like that. I don't know what they're putting in them or what the deal is, but they are good, okay? 
Try out and say, I told you so. I know everybody likes um, almond milk and oat milk. The Chibana milk. I just bought some last week because... Yeah, it was last week. No, it was Monday. Monday, my bad, y'all, because um, it was on sale. What was it? What's today? Oh. It was Thursday I got these because the sale started on... Th the new sale started on Thursday. So that's the, the Chibana that's back there in the back. You see them back there? And they're on BOGO. I want to get one for $4.99. I like to get them when they're bogo, but I've already got them. I just currently finished using the uh, California Farms. And you see that one over there that says coconut? That's the one I'm using right now, but I I was using the um, just the regular unsweetened one. So I'm trying that one right now in my um, iced coffees. So we'll see how it goes. It tasted pretty good, um, but I'm on the coconut one right now. And I tried it this morning, but actually, um, I really didn't, you really can't taste it, especially when you mix it with um, flavors, you know? Plant oat milk, I like that brand as well. The ripple is good for kids who don't like, um, you know, like, don't really like to drink milk or lactose intolerance and different things like that. It's good for them. They have a good culture probiotic milk. Have you ever tried Rubble? Let me know. All right, y'all. So I'm keeping a move with it. Let's go. Oh, I'll let y'all see some creamers. They also have the Chobana uh, creamers on sale. Buy one, get one. This is the time to wrap up at Publix when things are buy one, get one. White chocolate raspberry. That's good, y'all. That is real good. We go our Starbucks. You see they got the zero hazelnut now. White chocolate mocha is amazing. My dark and lovers. Starbucks girls. Anybody try a busy cold one? Hmm. Let me know in the comments. Can I have a yeah, sure. Hi. Whipped butter. Uh, what now? What's the what's whipped butter? It's not like whipped butter is like you know how when you're whipping, yeah, up like frosting, how icing comes out whipped. That's what whipped butter is like. Okay, so we're trying to make a garlic butter for our crabs, snow crabs. Okay, okay. You're trying to make a garlic butter? Yeah. Okay. Well, if you're trying to do a garlic butter for snow crabs, yeah, then you want to use the regular okay. butter, not the not the whipped butter. Okay. Yeah, it's the butter that's always used. The whole okay. whipped butter came out. Oh, okay. Okay. So like. Any and any, you want to unsalt it? It's okay. 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 Or you can get uh the uh, oh they don't have it in here. It's like the parquet that don't have the um yeah like this. Oh okay. Mm -hmm. Good. They don't have margarine in it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because I don't want it like oily. I want it to right, 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 right. right. So this good for baking or for doing ice cream. Okay. Because it, it doesn't. It's um it has more of a. It's not like the butter butter. Okay. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, I got you. I got you. Yeah, you know how that one is like, I can't believe it's not butter. Yeah. 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 So, uh, Thank you. yeah, you're welcome. You know, you can Google that too. <laughs> yeah, you can Google and find out too, like, which, which is the best. You know, to, to put in it because, you know, sometimes it be some good ideas from other people, you know what I'm saying? You know, that, that do it all the time. It, it, I'm sure it, it'll, it'll pop up. All you got to do is put in Google, um, what's the best butter for a crab oil? And see what it says, just to do something different. All right, have a good night. Uh, yeah, you're welcome, no problem. You want to get that? Look at right here. Huh? Oh, you like my tripod? Oh, thank you. Y'all, these are amazing. They are so good, y'all. They had a bogo on these. This brand, 
The cheddar cheese is good. My daughter loves that. We both love this chocolate drizzle right here. That one is the bomb. Okay, y'all. Try it. I Say it. I didn't tell you. Oh, you gotta get it. Oh, look at you. Thank you. Now, where is look it? Look at the public workers kept us out. Don't forget to check out my channel, J Quarters. What's your channel? J Quarters. J Quarters? All right. Y'all heard that? Follow J Quarters. Yeah, y'all, but um, for real though, these right here, this chocolate drizzle is so good, y'all. It's so, so, so good. And if you like just all cheddar cheese, or if you have any kids that like just all cheddar popcorn and it's hard to get it without the mix, Publix does have it, and this is amazing. And you can catch them BOGO, buy one, get one. They're regular $3.99. So I racked up on them. They were BOGO about three weeks ago, and I racked up on them for me and my daughter. Um, not a fan of those. Not a fan of any of those. And I can't never understand a Nutty Buddy popcorn because I, I just can't. It ain't even a reason why. And I can't even give you an explanation. It's just, I just would never understand that one. Strawberry shortcake one. No, wait a minute. I've never tried a strawberry shortcake. Your girl might have. Look, y'all, I'm going to wonder if I'm going to get it. Strawberry shortcake popcorn. Ooh, look at the packaging. Say it ain't so. You knew I'm fixing to get this. Okay? And I'm going to let y'all know about it. So, anybody get those. They have a honey apple crisp. Now, see, I ain't big on apples. Only way I eat apples is mixed up in a smoothie and um, I like a, a apple pie bait. Birthday cake tastes okay, but it's a little sweet. Black and white is the bomb. Peanut butter, you really gonna taste peanut butter if you really love it. Cake batter, really tastes like cake batter, okay? But this is new, honey apple crisp is new. And the one I got, the strawberry shortcake, that one must be the bomb because it's the last one there. So I got it, all right? So let's keep it moving. We got buy one, buy one, get one on birthday cake, cupcakes. If anybody's birthday is coming up this week or this weekend, you might want to come grab them for your little kids or something like that. Buy one, get one. That's a good deal. Go, go. The ding dongs, buy one, get one too. I don't eat all that type of sweet stuff like that. I try to, y'all, I try to save my sweets for um, crumble. <laughs> I try not to eat nothing at the end of the week, through the whole week. I don't eat that. I eat, um, actually, I just like sugar free peppermint patties. Um, these are my favorites right here. The spinach, spinach ones. It has spinach, broccoli, potatoes, and peas in it. Uh -huh. And I also like the, um, not the vinegar, not the vinegar. Well, they don't have the cheddar one. They're all out of the cheddar one, but the cheddar one I love. That's a sour cream and onion, which is okay. But the cheddar one is real good, y'all, but I don't see that they have any more cheddar. And so that tells you that it's real good because it's all gone, okay? So I try to use that as my alternative for um, sweets. Not sweets, my bad. Um, when I got a taste for, you know, chips and stuff like that, I don't want all that extraness. Um, yeah. Those, uh, these are good. I get these when I got a, like, you know, when I just want some plain chips because it's less salt. Um, kettle corn, I mean, I'm sorry. Kettle chips are actually better for you than the regular potato chips. Don't go back and forth with me on it. Here is the one I normally get right here. I was looking for it. That's the one I normally get right there. It's better for you if you want got taste for chips and you just like to eat some plain chips. Those are better. Um, don't don't go back and forth with me on it in the comments or nothing. Don't DM me telling me that's not true. Just do your own research, okay? Because you know, if I speak something on my channel, I've always done my research, okay? Because I'll do it for myself. And I just feel that I want to share it with you guys because just as well as I want to try to stay healthy, I would love for my subscribers, my roses, to stay healthy as well. Okay? So we all can be healthy together. All right? Because we all out here trying to live. We outside now. We we just, we trying to do it. Okay? So we, it take energy. It take a whole lot to do all that. So we just got to make sure we're eating and doing and getting the right things in our bodies. All right? So let's go.
when I say let's go, that's because I'm moving the buggy back again because I had kind of stopped. I like these as well. They eat with like if I want some uh, French onion dip. Instead of me getting regular chips, I get the baked glazed ones. And they are great. And matter of fact, I think I'm out of some. I think I need some more, but anyway, we're gonna get those as well. All right. If you honey barbecue ones here, they're good. My, my daughter likes to get those, these poppables sometimes. These were all on sale two for five about a week or so ago. My, and I wrapped up on them for my daughter because she only likes the barbecue and the sour cream and onion that's hidden down there for whatever reason. All right. All right. I'm only trying to get to the water, y'all. Nice. Let's see. Does anybody buy their roses or flowers from Publix? Does anyone? I never do. I always be going to, you know, Trader Joe's to get my flowers and things like that from. Here's some wine, y'all. My daughter likes those halos. Do y'all kids like halos? Well, I have a teenager. But kids like them too. All kids, pretty much. I like the baby spinach. That's what I like there. The baby spinach. And this green mix. Right there. Y'all, I know, I, I see a lot of this floating around on social media, um, different people, you know, be drinking these, but I'm going to show you the one. Okay, so I love this one here, okay? So, if you know about aspartame, this does not have aspartame in it, okay? It does not have aspartame in it. So, I get that. You don't want to get nothing much with aspartame in it. because aspartame is uh, not good for you. Um, do your research on it, but this is the one to get. So if you want any of these here, make sure you get the ones that don't have aspartame in it, okay? Make sure you get the one that don't have aspartame in it. I also get the this one here, the Zero Lemonade as well, and it doesn't have the aspartame in it. These do have aspartame. It did have aspartame in it. This one don't. This is a oh, this is a different one. Strawberry lemonade. This one don't. Oh, I might have to get it because it don't. Oh, you know what? I believe it is. I'm trying to see. It's one of them that has aspartame right here. This is the brand that has aspartame in it. And if you read the ingredients, you'll see the word aspartame down there. Okay, so. You don't want to get that one. The Mini Maid Zero, that one you don't want to get. And the reason why I don't get this one is because it don't, it's, zero, it's not zero sugar. So I only get this one and this one because it's zero sugar, okay? Y'all like watermelon? I don't like watermelon, y'all. I don't like it. 
Yo, I came in here for the BOGO um, water, not the BOGO water, but the water is 3 for 10. And then I also came in here for the fruit roll-ups. Um, okay, here is the water, 3 for 10. I'm going to put y'all down so I can get the water, all right? Because it's going to take two hands to do it. So y'all might be right there for a minute, but you're gonna see me. So this is what I came in here for, the water. That's three for 10. I like to grab them when they're three for 10, especially to keep them for backups when I'm at um, Zephyr Hills. Sometimes you can't find them. So the Publix one is good. 